When I was young, er, uh, in the late seventies and early eighties, when my hair wasn't gray, I used to order hockey cards, um, through, uh, a company called Cartophilium out of Montreal, Quebec. They used to advertise, uh, in the hockey news, a full page ad. Um, and I couldn't get over the fact that there was a place that you could order hockey cards from beside your corner store. There was no card stores, at least in my area yet. It was uh, a decade before the first big boom. I used to send away my 10 bucks or 15 bucks or 20 bucks for a 1977 or a 1978 OPG hockey set or something like that. And I would wait an agonizingly long time for the package to arrive. I thought it would get here in a matter of days. I used to um, get out of class to go and phone my mom from the, the principal's office. They had an old rotary phone. I think that's what you call it, an old phone um, for you youngins um, in the office. And I used to say I had to call my mom because I wasn't feeling good or something like that. And I would phone home and ask my mom if the mail had arrived and she knew what I was talking about. And every day it was, no, it hasn't arrived yet. No, it hasn't arrived yet. This would go on for like weeks. And then after about a month, it would finally arrive. And I couldn't, that whole day, I would be like, I, I couldn't think about anything else except running home and seeing the package and seeing what was inside. And um, I'm reminded of that by this, which is the latest consignment sent to us at AA Sports Cards. This did not take an agonizingly long time to arrive. It, it arrived in a matter of days. What I mean more is I could not wait for this package to arrive. And uh, when you see what's inside, I think you'll understand why I, um, I was um, so excited for this to arrive to AA Sports Cards. This is the latest consignment sent to us. You will see these cards on uh, eBay under Vahuda, V-A-H-O-O-T-A. -O -O say it with me. Say it loud. Say it proud. You will see these cards um, very, very shortly. Uh, as I told the gentleman when he um, sent me pictures of these cards and expressed interest in consigning them with us, I told him that the second they arrived, I would start working on them, and that is exactly what I am going to do. As soon as I turn my phone off for making this video, these are going to get worked on, and if they are not on eBay tonight, you will see them tomorrow. Packaged very, very well, as they should be, and uh, I did not do a pre-opening because, again, I want to, I want to revel in these cards and what's inside here and i wanted to experience opening opening them with you the viewer and uh, so there is a little bit of filibustering here and i want to open the bubble very very carefully i have so much bubble in the office that i could open my own bubble wrap store all right ladies and gentlemen a little more surgery before we commence. It will be worth the wait, I promise. Okay, so here are the cards in the consignment. And I'm just going to move this one down a bit. I'm going to save the last one for the main event. All three cards are worthy of main event status. But let's just start with this. The Jacques Plante rookie card. I mean, if you could imagine a better goalie pose, I don't know what it would be. The magnificent acrobatic Jacques Plante on his first hockey card ever. I'm, I'm looking at the card in the reflection of my phone. I just think this, this is marvelous. This card is graded a KSA 7 near mint so i want to focus on that a ksa 7 near mint a beautiful high-end jacques plant rookie card that you will see on ebay up for auction under our user id vahuda imminently 
The second card from this gentleman, from this fantastic consignment, is a Wayne Gretzky rookie card. I believe, yes, a KSA 9. High-end stuff, folks. And uh, again, I, I've said it many, many times, but you can't say it enough. I get to do this. I get to sell these cards on behalf of people. After a very long time in the business, and I've been doing this a long time, it's really uh, quite an honor to, to have the trust and faith in complete strangers who I've never met before, just talked to on the phone or by email, that have the trust in AA Sports Cards to send us their items. And I hope that if you're watching this across Canada and in the USA, because we have taken consignments from the States, that if you go on my website and read the testimonials from many past consigners, some of whom are still current consigners, and you read our Google reviews that you too might want to sell through us. If you are ready to sell or you want to, you want to sell, but you don't want to do the work yourselves. We uh, have 26 years experience on the largest marketplace in the world for sports cards, which is eBay. I've been doing it much longer than that. Um, we built up a very, very, very good business on eBay. We run auctions. We let the market decide the value. And as those words come out of my mouth, no truer sentence could be said because this is going to be a card that should be very interesting to watch. I have had this card fewer than five times in my life. In fact, this card is so amazing that I think I remember the four times I've had it previously in the 40 plus years I've been doing this. This is the fifth time I've had this card. I have not had it for a very long time. A C57, 1912 or 1913. Bobby Burrell will probably correct me. Sorry if I don't get the year wrong. I think it's 1912. C57, George Vesna. The key card in a, a set that's rarer than roast beef. And again, I cannot wait to see what the market tells us this card is worth. And again, there's many different ways someone can sell a collection. You can do it yourself. You can go to a show. You can, you know, do it on social media. Most people, um, you know, uh, it's a rabbit hole. It's not for everybody. We, if you sell through us, as I said, we run auctions. We let the market decide the value. Why sell to one person and get one person's price when we can expose the card to thousands and thousands of collectors and the highest bidder wins. The only way to win these cards, ladies and gentlemen, at auction is to be the highest bidder. And we work with you, the consigner, not against you. We have a vested interest in your stuff. We treat it like it's our own. The better you do, the better we do. And uh, I cannot think of a better three card consignment we have ever had. So thank you to this consigner. What an array, what a stunning lineup of cards. And I am, uh, I'm just can't wait to see what these cards bring at auction. So you will see all three of these on eBay under our user ID, Vahuda, V-A-H-O-O-T-A very shortly. If you want to consign with us uh, and you reside in, in Canada or again in the US, go to my website, aasportscards.com, read the testimonials. I'm very proud of them. Go on eBay, look up Vahuda, that's us. See uh, the kind of prices we're getting for our stuff. Real prices, that's what the market bears. Buy it now is are fine, but that's just one person's opinion of a price that he or she or they are hoping to get at auction. The prices that you see to me indicate what a card or a set or a piece of sports memorabilia is worth because that's what the market tells us it's worth. So anyway, Georges and I and Wayne and Jacques, we'll see you very soon. Stay tuned for lots more videos, try the ribs, and we will see you soon. Thanks, everybody. Can't wait to get started on this stuff. Take care.